हेलो फ्रेंड गुड मॉर्निंग एंड वेलकम बैक टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल दिस इज योर होस्ट खान बाबा गॉड विल गिव यू मोर हैप्पीनेस एंड लॉन्ग लाइफ आई ट्राई टू माय लेवल बेस्ट टू गिव यू लेटेस्ट अपडेट अबाउट इराकी दिन आ सो प्लीज लाइक एंड शेयर माय वीडियो विद योर फ्रेंड एंड फैमिली विच विल हेल्प मी फॉर सपोर्टिंग एंड नाउ लेट स्टार्ट द टूडे इन्फॉर्मेशन द सेंट्रल बैंक ऑफ इराक डिनाइड इशूइंग अ न्यू करेंसी डिनोमिनेशन The decision highlights the bank's confidence in the strength and stability of the Iraqi dinar, even as other economies toy with the idea of introducing new denominations, new currencies coming out in Iraq. Not true. The Iraqi dinar is the currency of Iraq. As far as any new smaller denominations, they will be introduced only as needed if and when the value increases and warrants so. There is no significant RV. I do have some reports of a few groups that were requested to update NDAs this weekend. There were multiple reports, which is interesting. A couple of these sources I know personally, so believe it is spot on. This is from grouped currencies, not individuals like you and I. With updating their NDAs, the leaders are expecting something very soon. In the coming days means at any moment now the articles are going to be showing pictures of the lower notes it's also going to give descriptions in the articles of the lower notes parliamentary legal department the budget will be dispersed and will not be affected by appeals there's been some misunderstanding about that out there you don't want the budget to be approved because if it's approved it's approved with dinar at today's central bank value 1310 What you want is the court to overturn the approval. Iraq had a good sit-down meeting this weekend with the International Finance Corporation. They are on the world stage now. Everything is going really well in Iraq. There is still an excellent chance we will get to quietly go in exchange before the rate is published in the Gazette. They are certainly trying to keep it quiet just like they did with Kuwait when they silenced communication out of Kuwait for over a week before the rest of the world got to know. But I don't think this could happen in today's world and the internet. I talked to my bank friend. He said when we do drop the zeros, we the citizens will have a certain number of days to return for new lower currency. This will be the one to one. Not one dollar for one dinar, but twenty-five k note for a twenty-five note. It will revalue in country above a dollar. We will probably see dinar in country just over one dollar. Now, do you see why they kept it at thirteen twenty? The one to one will be dropping off the three zeros from our exchange rate from our currency. A twenty-five k note will be a twenty-five note. This is for inside of country, not outside of country. The IMF is not going lop the Iraqi dinar. A lop is a tool the IMF uses to restart a currency from massive inflation. We also have articles for Iraq telling us they will not lop the dinar. They do not have massive inflation, and so this tool of a lop is not necessary. Thank you for watching my video. Take care and goodbye.